All right, so yesterday. Huh? There. Oh. <laughs> it's like 100, and my wife told me to turn the air on. Here we go. Turn it on. All right. So yesterday, had a friend on uh, Facebook reach out to me because, well, live in Arizona and you could carry guns out here. And I've been trying to find a place to go shooting because it seems like they're closing down all these places to go shooting. So yesterday, I took that champ out to the desert, found a new spot referred to by my Facebook buddy. Turn that down again. They referred to by my Facebook buddy, so went shooting, got to shoot my AR and my and my heckler and conch. And so car's all dirty. I was gonna go shooting again today, but I don't think it's gonna happen. Uh, instead, we're gonna hang out. And guess what, everybody? Safety first. Put your kids in their seats. So everybody's safe. All right, so we'll get to today's topic in just a minute, but after about a 30 minute drive with this beautiful thing, we arrived at our destination where we're gonna have lunch. So again, today's topic is being yourself. I think it's very important that we uh, talk about this. A couple years ago, my wife and I stepped down from uh, youth ministry. Uh, we used to be youth pastors at a church. And we did that for about 12 to 13 years. And so um, the reason why I bring that up is because I know that when we were involved in the youth ministry uh, over a period of time, we actually would analyze, or I would more predominantly analyze other youth ministries and would always wonder like, man, what is it that they're doing that I'm not doing that I could be more successful or reach more kids? And so uh, one of the big things that I found myself doing was critiquing, uh, critiquing myself in a negative way, comparing myself to other youth pastors and, um, you know, having an understanding as far as like uh, doing like YouTube or anything that you're either involved in. Um, the worst thing we could do is compare ourselves with other people. I saw so many people that uh, I wanted to be like. I saw people, I saw youth pastors that had groups that were large. I saw that they uh, did activities that were like really engaging and, and for me I liked that I wanted to do that. And the difficult thing about that was our youth ministry wasn't a huge youth ministry. And so uh, the onset, you know, the thought process that I had was, well, like I'm a failure if I don't have a lot of kids coming to my youth group or I'm a failure if, um, you know, if, if we're not doing the things that these other youth pastors are doing. And that is, that's a lie, you know, that's, that's just a bunch of bull. Um, failures uh, aren't a result of not having a certain amount of people. Uh, in fact, um, if you actually step out, so like I'm stepping out with YouTube, and, um, you know, I, I like, or I subscribe to Peter McKinnon, Matty Apuya, his brother Depo, and Casey Neistat. And I subscribe to their channels, and man, they do so many amazing things as far as their video content that they produce. It, it's, it's really cool, and I aspire to be like that, but I'm, not, I'm never gonna be them. Uh, for you guys that are watching this, you're never gonna be me. And so, uh, the main thing about being you is, you know, that's one thing that I've discovered with doing my channel is there's only one person that's like me and that's me. There's only one person that's like you and that's you. Nobody can be who you are and we're not meant to be like other people. We're meant to be us. And so what makes, if you guys are doing YouTube uh, on your own, if, you're, if you have your own channels, um, your Facebook channel, Instagram, whatever, uh, you're sharing your content, you're sharing your heart, you're sharing your experiences, and that's what I wanna do as far as my channel is concerned. I wanna be able to share 
my life. I want to share my experiences and not try to live up to be like somebody else. I want to be me. And so that's the whole thing as far as uh, YouTube is concerned is presenting content, creating things, and discovering more about myself, what I'm capable of doing, and not ever about trying to be like anybody else. So, uh, so today, that's what I want to challenge you with. My friends over here, oh, actually one of them is my son. That's my son sitting down, and then that's my military friend. I, I, I used to be his youth pastor a long time ago. Anyway, why'd you duck down when I did that, EC? My son's trying to, he was trying to hide. He didn't want to be on YouTube. So, um, so be you, don't be embarrassed, uh, but be courageous. Uh, we're gonna have some fun. So we got some things here. I want you to check it out. So, right now I don't have anything on, but how do you want to see me with all my get up? All right. So, we're gonna get down, okay? AR-15, body armor, HKVP9, uh, SIG, P320, and my son is gonna get down, all right? 